What's up guys, Rob from MyPPCTraining.com. I'm the handsome guy over to your right. <laughs> so today's video, we are going to go through Google's AdWords Auction Insights. Okay, this is something that's really overlooked by a lot of marketers or they've never even heard of it. And basically what it lets you do is pull the curtain back and get a peek at how your competitors are doing versus yourself. So let's just get right into it. Go into your AdWords campaign. You can see here we're in our white label campaign. We're going to pop into the campaign, check out the ad, well, let me remove these first. I don't know why I still have those. Okay. We're going to look at the ad group level. You're going to click all your ad groups. You're going to come up here to auction insights and you're going to see yourself up here. And these are all your main competitors. And it kind of gives you six different data points here. I think it's six, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I thought so. Okay. All right. So um, obviously your stats are up here. I don't know why ours are not pulling it from here right now, but here's our main competitors and you can kind of see what they're doing. And this is a good way to see what they might be spending on AdWords. Okay. So you can kind of get a feel for what your competition is spending budget wise. Now you'll see here where our impression share is almost double than most of our competition so let's say if we're spending a hundred dollars a day we know that our our top three competitors are spending around sixty dollars a day and this guy fifty all right so that can kind of give you a better idea of what's going on budget wise with your competition you can see their average positions so let's just go through real quick the columns here that the data points it gives you so impression share and you guys probably if you watch my videos always hear me talking about this because it's so important Impression share is the number of impressions you receive divided by the estimated number of impressions you are eligible to receive. So if I have a 96% impression share, that means out of every 100 searches that my keyword triggers, 96% of the time my ads are going to show. All right, so that's, that's pretty damn good. Obviously, we want 100, but <clears throat> we'll get there. Average position, pretty self-explanatory, is the average position shows how your ad typically ranks against other ads. So it's all of your different ads positions they show up in just average together that's really all it is so we can see we're 1.5 exactly where i want to be overlap rate this can be a little confusing so i'll just leave the definition right up here overlap rate is how often another advertiser's ad received an impression in the same auction that your ad also received an impression all right so we're um you can see these guys have some pretty decent overlap rates but i don't know why ours is not showing all right so every search this guy gets 60, 62% of the searches are overlapping with uh, other competitors. Position above rate is how often another advertiser's ad in the same auction shows in a higher position than your own when both of your ads were shown at the same time. All right. <clears throat> so this is, um, you can kind of get a feel for what's going on here. This is really low position above rate. Interesting. Uh, top of page rate. Top of page rate is how often your ad or the ad of another advertiser, depending on which row you're viewing, was shown at the top of the page in the search results. So our ads are showing out of every keyword search that we're bidding on, 91% of the time our ads show they're in the top of the page. That's pretty awesome. Um, another competitor, you can actually sort these by different metrics too, by the way. So you can kind of get a feel for that. Outranking share is how often your ad ranked higher in the auction than another advertiser's ad or if your ad showed when theirs did not. All right. Oh, let me find us again. What the hell is going on with us? There we go. All right. So th and there is a bidding strategy for outranking share too. If you just want to, and just to touch on it briefly, um, let's say we wanted 51blocks.com. Let's say we always wanted our ads to show above their domain no matter what. You can use a bidding strategy called target outranking share and actually just make sure your ads never show below theirs. So there's that. But this is just something cool. You can pop in and see what your competitors are up to, what they're spending, their impression share, their average positions, um, how you compare when your ads trigger together, all that stuff right up here. And um, I highly recommend that you guys at least check this out when you're running your ads because it can give you a good indicator of if you need to spend more or bid more to get better positions and stuff like that and kind of see what your competition's up to. So as always, if you guys like this video, give me a thumbs up. I really appreciate that. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We're doing daily videos now, multiple videos a day. So that's important. And also check out the links in the description. I dropped some cool stuff in there for you. 
Other than that, I will see you in the next video.